Hello everyone and welcome to my Nora Bay Farms here in Stardew Valley. My name is Melanie B. Thanks for joining me for this episode. It is now the third of summer in year two. So it looks like it's a semi-good luck day. Let's head out and check on our crops. I don't think anything is going to be ready yet. Let me go ahead and drink some espresso and I'll grab a crab cake from here. So it's double speed time. Okay, and let's have a quick look at the animals. Where are you, my wonderful animals? Hiding amongst the grass. Let's check on the barn animals. Hello, hello. Everyone is looking well. Okay. I'm going to double check. Actually, I'm not going to go into the greenhouse. Put some of this stuff away. I would like today to go to the desert, even though it's not like a really good luck day, it's partially good luck, which is kind of the same thing, not really. Okay, let's, it's back in there, this can go in there, and that can go there. What I want to do is go out to the desert and look in on my tree farm, my hardwood tree farm that I started. Um, last time I checked, it was not doing so well. So we need to see if we can maybe make some fertilizer for it. Do I even have a recipe for tree fertilizer? I do. It's right here. You know, I also have a recipe for a bone mill. So I'm actually going to make this, and I'm going to start uh, getting some fertilizers produced from the bone mill. Might as well do that. Stick it in here. And let's check how many bones we have. We don't have a whole lot. But we'll toss a few in there. We have iridium bars now, but what we are short on is batteries. One place we can get batteries is actually in Skull Cavern from the iridium bats. Um, it's kind of a rare drop, unfortunately, so we might not be able to acquire as much as we need. So we are really going to have to depend on the thunderstorms. to get the some batteries. Let's put some more strawberries up here. Okay. I'm gonna set the potato juice aside for Pam. Like that. And like that. I'm going to take an apricot to Emily. I think I put the apricot away though. Yes, let me set that aside so I don't forget it next time. And go on a little good thing spree. Sell some of these wines. Oh, that's a lot <laughs> of strawberry wine. Not strawberry wine, but the, the kind of wine is this. Our fruit wine. There we go. Okay, so let's put a few things away and head out. See what we can find in the desert. Maybe we should actually plant some plant some more tree seeds out there. And I can get the tapper farm started. 
Yeah, I think I like that idea a little bit better. Let's do that instead. So, I need to go get some pathing to put down. Make a bunch of these ones. We have so much stones, it's not even going to matter. Okay. And the tree fertilizer, it's really like. I don't know how much fibers I have. Let's turn on advanced crafting so we can see better. So, we do have quite a bit of fiber, so yeah, I'll make a few of these. And get a bit of each type of seeds. I'll definitely do all the mahogany seeds. I'll do 10. Let's do 10 of each. So let's also make 10 more tree fertilizers. Okay. Let's go. That away for now, put that away, put that away. Let's sell these and let's be on our way. Well, as soon as Pam gets here. Blank spot. Very weird. Off we go, and we'll get to do a bit of foraging in the desert as well. Because there should be some coconuts and cactus fruits that we can get. Now I'm thinking I should probably buy a whole bunch more star fruit seeds since we do have that quest. To oh look, our hardwood trees finally started to grow. Awesome! We'll cut these ones down. Wonderful. At least some of them grew. So I will start it over here. Okay, so we'll plant mahogany trees first. So one, two, go every other one. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Yeah, we definitely need to purchase uh, way more starfruit suits because we do need to have 200 starfruits for the Junimo class in the Aurora Vineyard. So that's something I have to work on as well. But that's not a priority. Like, I still want to get to Ginger Island. That is still the main priority. Oh, I'm short. That's okay. <laughs> Get these ones in next. Now the tree fertilizer is going to make a whole lot of difference in how quickly these ones are going to be ready. And that one will go there. That's okay. We'll have one less. 
some pines in. And done. So we have exactly enough. We'll just have one extra because we couldn't do all of them. And perfect. So hopefully these ones will be. I wonder if I can still put fertilize on this. Ah, still can. That's amazing. Okay, let's grab some more of the forage. And we'll try seeing how far we can get down into Skull Cabin and if we can maybe find, get lucky and find some Iridium bats. And get like a whole ton load of batteries. <laughs> I think that's fairly unlikely. But one can hope. Okay, there's another one, some more over here. Okay, anything over on this side? No. There's one more here. I think we got most of them. All, maybe more. A few trees down as well. Okay, and I'm just going to make a little chest and store my extra stuff in here. So I'll put the seeds, put that, put that, 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 all of this stuff we don't really need to, just need to remember to grab some of these things before we head out at the end of the day. Okay, and I don't need to take my axe in there. Okay, so let me... Get this organized, this like that. We have mushrooms, which is not the ideal food for a skull cavern, but we'll give it a go. Hope not to die. First floor, we get a diamond, not too bad. But what we want is a whole bunch of shafts. I don't think, I think the Iridium bats don't come until like level 50 maybe. I'm not one of percent sure on that though. Get out of here, slime. Oh, there's my ladder. Take that serpent. Need a whole bunch of shafts to get seriously deep. But, like, if I can just find some iridium, oh, here's a shaft. Just jump in. Seven levels, not bad. There we go. Eat some mushroom. Don't want to help to get too low. This isn't the best of luck day, so I can't really expect to get a lot. Got a spicy eel out of that guy. 
which I will gladly accept. Let's go down. Dispatch these ghosts. They going with you. Oh, shaft. Nice. Five levels. Oh, take it. Okay, let's uh spiral level. My favorite. Okay, these guys are coming really fast. I guess that is to be expected. That's their nature. Come oh, on, give me another shaft. I'd also like to get some treasure rooms. Wouldn't complain about that. Treasure rooms with auto petters. That would be awesome. So far, at 17, no sign of iridium. Come on, here we go, take the ladder. Give me some iridium ores and veins. Be good over here. I'll grab a mushroom. Grab some ores. Take this jade. Let's look on this other side. Anything good? Take the emerald. Come on, give me a little bit of decent luck at least. Nope, nothing good. Oh, here we go, ladder. Anything good over here? Nope. Oh, ladder. Oh, I'll grab all this coal though. Coal is always good and needed. Come on, drop shaft. Well, this is just totally unlucky. Oh, there we go. And another spiral four. Okay, come on. I'm almost hoping for a swarm of bats, of iridium bats. Which might be crazy, but it might be good too.
Well, I didn't hear that guy coming at all. Snuck up on me. Being sneaky. Grab some of these mushrooms before I go. Oh, it's already 11. I don't think I'm gonna make any more fours. Uh, swarm. Just about to head out anyways. We'll try to take a few of them out before we go though. So let me see what I got here. Hmm. Okay, so what should we take back with us? I will take my hoe and my axe for sure. And we'll take the iridium. Uh, we'll take the wood and take that, 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 that. I'll leave the seeds here. I'll definitely take the coal back with me. I'll take the refined quartz. I'll we'll take this stuff. I'm um, we'll take the syrup, the loot. And we'll take all the gems. Okay. I think we're good, but we have the bombs here for sure, because this is most likely the place to use it, so, yeah, let's do that, well, let's hop on the bus, after destroying a few more of these trees, it's still pretty early. I still think I have to catch the scorpion carp in these waters out here. I don't think I've done that as yet. So I might have to bring my fishing rod with me on the next trip. And back to Pelican Town we go. Thanks for staying up late, Pam. Appreciate it. That would really suck if you actually had to do that, where you have to stay and wait for a client to finish. Oy. Okay, let's head to bed. Did I sell anything less yesterday? Um, yeah. Oh, I sold all the wine. Holy! That is some good money. 153000 I will take it. I will definitely take it all day, every day. So, still need to get a bunch of hardwood. It's uh, Jazz's birthday. It's a really good luck day, though. Oh boy, where do you want to go? Where do we want to go? What's our priority? I, I really want to go to the mines. I do. And I want to like get down a bunch, so I'm thinking about staircases, but I think what I really need is a whole bunch of bombs. So let me make a couple kegs here. Get rid of this stuff though. But I think if I were to have more bombs, then I can descend faster for sure. What do I need for bombs? Problem is the coal, always the coal. Do I want to use my 14 coal and make 14 bombs? Yeah. I wish I had access to the dwarf, because that would make things a whole lot easier, because then I could just buy some from him. But I don't. Got some fertilizers, it's good. So I'll put these in here, I guess. 
So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head to the regular mines and focus on like getting the dwarf scrolls instead because I really need to get those. At the end of the day, that's what I really need. So let's do that. Go put out these two new kegs. See if the potato juice is ready for Pam. There we go. Okay, no potato juice yet. But it should be any day now. And what should we get for Jazz? No, she likes the fairy rose. I don't think I have any fairy rose flowers though. What else does she like? I think she likes cake, the pink cake as well. Don't have that. So I really don't have anything I can give to Jazz. Do I have a recipe for pink cake? I'm not seeing it. Am I glossing over it? Where are you, pink cake recipe? Maybe that's it. That doesn't look like I have it. That's unfortunate. So maybe I'll just give her a flower, the daffodil, and hope she likes that. Get that there. Okay, let's check the animals and we'll we'll go ahead and grab the coffee and whatever else is ready in the in the greenhouse. I believe yesterday the tree fruits were all ready, so I should have gone in and harvested yesterday, but I didn't. That's okay. We'll get it today. What if she'd like something like a rabbit's foot? Let's see if we even have one. Uh, nope, oh, rabbit's feet. Okay, it's gonna be a daffodil for her. Let's go check on the barn animals. Hello, 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 everyone. Love, 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 love. There we go. Probably should kind of clear out down here a bit more. Let's head into the greenhouse. I also need to go and do some, plant some of the forage seeds on out by the external crop site. I need to really pay attention on what days I'm doing it just so I can make sure to collect it on the right day. Okay, got all those. Now the thing about having the trellis here is that I am blocked from going across. So I'm gonna have to go around. I suppose it's fine. Oh, missed a couple. Might be interesting trying to harvest all these these hops. Anything else ready? Oh, we got strawberries. Okay. And is any ancient fruit ready? Yes, perfect. Get those into the seed maker. See what we can get from these this time. Hopefully we get 10. Because that's what we deserve. We deserve 10. <laughs> Last time we did not get 10, and that was upsetting. Okay. Let's 
still thinking I might want to move this down. Mm, it'll be fine. We'll leave it just as it is. And I need to get a couple more sprinklers in here to get these crops all wetted. Oh, I got 10 this time. Oh, more than 10. 11. That kind of makes up for <laughs> the last time, I guess. I'll get all these planted. Yes. That's awesome. There we go. Okay, let's head back out to the farm. We'll process all our coffee and strawberries. And I am going super slow for absolutely no reason. When I can go way faster, let's go get some crab cakes. First, we're going to just put these into the keg for processing. We'll have one more potato juice. I'll leave it in here for now. Where did I get that pine? really need to harvest like a whole bunch of wood and I just keep saying I'm gonna do it just actually do it probably should put out some more lightning rods the next day I know for sure there's gonna be lightning I'll do that get that set but who knows if that's ever gonna happen we may never see thunder or lightning again. It certainly is starting to feel like that. Oh, what did I do with Jazz's present? <laughs> I stacked it, didn't I? Okay, let's grab it back out of here. Make sure there's nothing else she would... I wonder if she likes fairy stones. I don't want to experiment. Let's just go with the daffodil. Okay, we've got some product harvested. Lots of truffles. Jazz, where are you today? Are you at home? Are you by the swing? Or are you at school in the library? Oh, I've seen instead. Jane? Oh dear. Melanie V, can you do something? He's out cold. Burr. So I whip out my watering can and wake him up. Shane, what's the matter with you? All you do anymore is mope around your room and drink beer. You wouldn't understand. I'm worried. In comes Jazz. What's your plans? Don't you ever think about the future? Plan? Hopefully I won't be around long enough to need a plan. You made Jazz cry. On her birthday, no less. Oh, he's in some deep agony there. Because obviously that's not what he wants to do. Okay, where are you, Jazz? 
It's not in here. So she might be at school. At the library. Let's head over to the museum. Hey, Emily. We can't talk because I don't want to accidentally give you this present that I'm running with in my hands for absolutely no reason. I wonder if she likes ice cream. Mm. No, she's not here. Where are you, Jazz? Say hi to Haley though. If she's been to sun a lot, it will make your hair lighter. But you don't want to get sunburned either. Say hi to Alex. Oh, okay, maybe up by the the playground area. Hey Sebastian. Um let's grab this. Grab this. I wonder if the sweet pea is a better gift than the daffodil. Hi, Demetrius. You know what? I have this ice cream. I know you like it. There you go. Where are you, Jazz? Down at the beach, maybe? Where could those children be? Hey, Lily. Have you seen Jazz or Vincent? Take all that stuff. Get back on the quest to find Jazz. Another shard. Oh, so Vincent's here, but where is Jazz? Ah, this is all this goodies, but I can't resist. I'm probably, I'm just gonna head back to Marnie's. See if she's gone home for the day. Alia, I'm still thinking about proposing to Leah versus Haley. I think Shane is also an option. I can't decide. Okay, let's hope she went back to her room and she's at home right now. Jazz, you're wasting my entire day. Oh, no. No. Why, why did you do that to me, game? Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. And now I lost all that wood, too. <laughs> okay. Did I go to the mine still? I mean, I still do need to get the dwarf scrolls, so. The trip to the mine is still in order. I need to I have so much stuff with me, though. Ah, uh, my inventory is practically full. Well, uh, let's not go to the mines. It's foraging time. I can't believe we missed Jazz. Like, how? Where was she? Like, where could she have gone to? It's like she was hiding from getting a present. Why? Why would you hide, Jazz? Maybe because she knew she wouldn't like it? I don't know. Maybe 
I should put my tapper farm up here. I need to remember to actually make the tappers for the tapper farm. But those trees aren't going to be grown for a while. I'm going to take this and put it into the kiln. And get a whole bunch of charcoal. Because that still is the bane of my processes. And we'll take a quick trip down into this area. See if there's anything interesting. Not really. Oh, there's some porch though. But I have no space. Perfect. Need to keep that. Don't need that. I'll get rid of the clay. And should I get rid of my coal? Uh no. <laughs> Absolutely not. Um yeah, we'll get those. What is this? Ah, there's all these different types of forage. Okay, I have to come down here more often. There's even like red and purple mushrooms. Okay, yeah, I have to come down here more often. I'm going to go further in. Oh, do I have space for any hardwood even? No. Ugh. Get rid of the ice cream. No, maybe the daffodil. Yeah, buy daffodil. Gosh, hardwood is way too precious. Ah! Where did all those guys come from? Ah, uh, run away. <laughs> They were all coming at me at once, like all four of them. Holy cow. I should have stayed and fight. Oh well. Okay, let's go back to the farm and put this stuff away. Yeah, we got plenty of time. Sure, sure. Not really. But we have enough time to put this stuff away, and I will get all this wood into the charcoal kiln. So we can start smelting some bars again. Okay, so I'll put the new forage in here. What is that? Macadamia nut. That's pretty cool. I like that. Did I not get another forge? Thought I did. Oh yeah, this thing. Pine nuts. That is pretty awesome. I'll trade that for this one. And we'll keep these in our fridge for cooking sashimi. And we can put that in there. And wrong one. Put these torches in here. And we have one donation. Well, you know, I didn't get to give Jazz a present. I still, still got a few good things. So I'll sell that. And not that. And 
see at center. Let's call it a very late night. Oh, it's in Madrid again. Did we make some good money today? Not really. Didn't sell much. We made 375 G. Not bad. Not good, but not bad. <laughs> well, that is it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching.